Hi everyone, it's Kendra Dublin and we are back for another lesson from our Stop Running From Online Ministry series. And your low self-confidence is delaying your online ministry. You've been saying, well, nobody cares what I have to say, but if God is the one that asks you to say it, <laughs> then he's already given the people the ears to hear it. Whether you are the evangelist, uh, the one that is the speaker that's more of the evangelist side and you, people are coming to you or whether you're the person that is more on the discipleship side of speaking and authorship and helping with uh, transformation, wherever God is, is taking you within the online ministry, he has called you uh, to say something that actually matters to certain people. So you saying that nobody cares is just a lie. And it's a lie from the enemy. And it's a lie that you keep saying to yourself that it just isn't true. There's a whole lot of people that care. And if God placed it in you, there's somebody for it. There is somebody for that word. Or we say, oh, it's not important. It's important enough to God if he gave you the vision. It's important. It's the small things. A lot of times it's those nuanced things. A lot of times that we say and do, that's the very thing that gets people to saying yes to God. Or that gets pe people to say, you know, I want to live more of a transformed life or I do actually want to live out my purpose. And how can I actually work full time in the, in the purpose? But here you are talking about some nobody cares. It's a lie. It's a lie. For those that want to be authors and, you know, I'm not really good enough to be an author. And what I have to say is not going to be that important. And you start to get scared as to what to share. God placed that in your heart because it is going to be impactful. <laughs> it wasn't anything that you decided. God said, that's what I want. And he put that desire in you for you to do his work. And because you are a part, if you don't do your part, the body continues to suffer. So all of this, nobody cares. It's a lie. Nobody cares what I have to say when I go and speak out on the stage. It's a lie. Nobody cares about this, this business that God has given me. It's a lie because he gave it to you. That means there's somebody waiting for it and need it. And need it. <laughs> they need it. And Moses was, would say, you know, well, you know, who am I that Pharaoh will listen to me? He's making all these excuses as to why Pharaoh wouldn't listen to him. And God is like, what, what, what about me? What, what about what I said? If I'm telling you to do something, it's going to happen. I'm telling you to do something. It's for a reason. And somebody's going to listen. But that low confidence gets us into thinking that we can't do the work that God has called us to do. And it's just another lie from the enemy that we perpetuate every single day. But imagine if you were not just confident in yourself, but actually confident in God, your confidence was rooted in God, how that would change your life right now. And put it in the comment section, if you could be confident in God and what he said, how would that get you going? And then how would that get you going for the ministry that he has called you to? Go ahead and leave that self-confidence that nobody, that low self-confidence that nobody cares in the past. Because somebody cares is why God gave it to you. And go ahead and work towards that today. Because tomorrow is too late to be great. <laughs> 